Hey guys, Weasel here, and today we're gonna to be playing House Flipper. A game where we, well, flip houses. We take rundown houses and turn them into beautiful mansions. But before we can do that, we have to work our way through some grunt work and make sure we have satisfied customers. Man, if cleaning up things was just so easy. Wait, is this where I live? Why is there cigarette butts all over the ground? Am I living here or is it a crack junkie? This is a nightmare, I, ugh. Well, I guess it's time to make some money. Who would hire me? Ex-boyfriend stole the radiator from your house? Sure, I'll install a radiator for you. Remove trash, clean dirt, mount devices. Okay, fine, I'll clean up. So I can pick up your furniture. Can I just put it anywhere or does it need to be on the floor? I was hoping I could put it in the yard. I guess, I guess not. What happened here? What did your boyfriend do? Did he murder a pig in here? Oh God, I'm gonna be sick. This is awful. Well, this isn't gonna be on HGTV anytime soon. Now we get to upgrade. I want a ultra hyper mob. Oh, it's just a good mob. I mean, I might not be able to put things outside, but I can certainly put them in this room. Yeah, let me just take the whole kitchen cabinet out of here. Look, it's so much cleaner already. Well, if you ask me, it's way more cleaned up. Nobody said I couldn't just put everything into the other rooms. I mean, how else am I gonna clean the floor if I don't, you know, put everything away? Yeah, you don't need your toilet, right? Nah. Oh yeah, right, you want the radiator, I, I forgot. A job well done. Perfect. Oh, so much better. I think this is my favorite new feature. All right, give me the next job. I can't wait. Cleaning the garage? Fine. Wait, I can pick up his car? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Why would I? You know what? I'll get back to you in a bit. Oh, sure is filthy. Okay, now I'm gonna get the ultra hyper mob. I don't know, it just looks like pretty standard mob, apart from it going through my fingers. All tasks complete? I don't think so. I know they wanted me to just clean up the garage, but it's just like that extra bit of service that I do. <laughs> it fits. There's still a plenty of room in there. I think the most evil thing that I've done so far is take the toilet paper. I wonder what the first thing is they're gonna notice when they come back to their house. Is it when they're gonna open the door to find half their furniture in their hallway? Or is it this friendly little bunny with the axe? I mean, I cleaned up the garage. You can now find every tool very easily because it's very accessible. I would show you more of the rest of the house, but it's kind of hard to get through all of this. But no worries. You can always get in for the back of the house. Oh wait, that's right. You can't. <laughs> well, if you need to get into your car, you can just climb through this window and there you go. Ah yes, another job well done. It's just that extra customer service, you're welcome. Oh, did you know that you can add your own pictures? Yeah, I didn't know either. It's beautiful. And because I like that picture so much, I took another picture of the picture. And then to remind me of that, I put a picture of a picture of a picture over my desk. And of course I need something to keep me warm in this long, cold nights. All right, enough fucking around. Time for another job. Baby on the way. <laughs> For a second I read, Matt Marlowe, soon to be dead. Oh, we get to paint. Fantastic. Holy shit. What is it with these people and throwing cigarette buds and all kinds of shit on the floor? You're not ready to have a baby. You're not ready for society. Holy moly, are you kidding me? Wait, I have a sell objects gun? And I just, we're not playing thief simulator. God dang it. Paint with the colors, pastel pink. Oh boy, this is gonna take a while, isn't it? Yeah, you don't need to clean the walls if you can just paint them. Pro tip, saves you a lot of time. Man, this is just as exciting as it is in real life. Okay, everything's painted, that's great. So I can't sell anything, but I can buy things and just place them in here. Like this very handy webcam. How about I just put that right over here? Yeah, you're not even gonna know it's there. Ah yes, another job. Well done. I kinda just decided to paint a bunch of their stuff. It even looks kinda cool. I mean, you know, for the most part. <laughs> Perfect, you can sit right next to the baby crib. That kitchen looks so much more cleaned up than before. <laughs> you can't really see a whole lot what's going on. But I, I really like how this is all coming together. It gives it this feng shui. I will pay you if I'm fully satisfied or you get nothing. Oh boy, let's, let's see about that. Well, I did everything he wanted me to do, but I kind of feel like 
I want to satisfy him a little bit more. You know, who, do who doesn't want the fridge right in front of the toilet so you can just open it up, grab a beer, and just... You never have to get off the toilet again. It's so efficient. And you also don't need to go into your house, right? I, th I still think I'm missing something, and I have a little bit of a budget to get creative. I mean, after all, I'm an artist. Who wouldn't be happy seeing this when they come into their home? I mean, you never have to buy toilet paper, like, ever again. I mean, given how things are right now, I'm pretty much made you rich. Another job well done. <laughs> That's so much better. All right, no time to waste, time for the next job. Wait, you want additional walls? Oh, absolutely. Well, let's see what we got. Modify the room layout, destroy the walls, build the walls. I'm on it. Oh, yes. Well, walls destroyed. So you're telling me I can't just destroy more walls? Well, let's see about that. New skill point available? Upgraded hammer or faster demolition? Ooh, that's a, that's a tough choice. You're telling me I can place walls wherever I want? Well, don't mind if I do. You know what's even better than storing things away? Walling them in. I like how this is now considered a living room with a kitchenette because the, the fume hood is like in the hallway. You didn't need windows anyway, right? Well, boy, I seem to have uh, built myself in. Um, I'm just gonna crawl out the window. So when you wanted me to remove the walls, this is what you had in mind, right? Just put a new divider in, something like this. Yeah, no, absolutely. I, th I think it did a terrific job. And your furniture is in the basement behind the new wall. I like that I still got paid a few thousand dollars for that. All right, next job. Ah, we got our first renovation job. Job, a new beginning. Are you ready to help John and Nicole renovate the house of their dreams? You will have to make some decisions. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. A budget of six and a half thousand dollars. Ooh, sign me up. Oh God, you're, you're horrifying. Why are you looking at my mouse? You like that mouse? You like that, you like that mouse? Hmm, what a weirdo. All right, we got ourselves a budget. Let's see what we can make happen with six and a half thousand dollars. Ooh, we get to make our first decision. Sauna and a bathroom. Being able to hop in the sauna after swimming in the sea sounds fantastic. Just cleaning up it will it suffice. This is a very capable storage room. Yeah, let's, let's build a sauna and a bathroom. Oh my God, what kind of toilet is this? Well, this is the perfect sauna and the perfect bathroom. Last but not least, the toilet. Look at that, we still have quite a bit of budget to go. I'm a decorator god. I get to make another decision. Definitely a TV, the room feels so empty without it. Or a fireplace. Why not both? You know what, she got the sauna, so you're gonna get the fireplace. Now where to put this bad boy? <laughs> Game, why are you letting me do those things? Why? Perfect. None of that annoying fire. Okay, we have a little bit of budget left. And the guy wanted some plants, so uh, I'll give you some plants. Wait, are you telling me I can put toilets anywhere? Perfect, you don't even have to leave the bedroom anymore. Well, it looks like we still have uh, a budget of $1,500. Do we get to keep those? Because I'm pretty sure this is, this is perfect the way it is. Nailed it. The transformation, it's, it's, it's unbelievable. <laughs> Just that little toilet added to it. Well, did I make some money with this? How successful was it? I didn't get any feedback. Walls to knock down. Ooh, large rooms have become popular. You came to the right person. All right, so you want these walls taken out. Easy peasy. You want a big room? You'll get a big room. You know, I'm not gonna get paid for the extra demolition, but to be honest, I'll do it for free. Well, let me give you the full tour of the new open space area. Uh, as you can see, we decorated a little bit. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm particularly proud of this new design element that I call absolute horror nightmare. What? Nope. Oh good, they're alive. This got so much better. Well, it's a big open space and uh, some of the walls are painted. It never ceases to amaze me what the game thinks is an acceptable state to finish a job. Sure, I'll, I'll, I'll get paid. It looks so much better. Just the colors really pop with that extra light coming in through these open holes. Oh, uh, that's gotta be my favorite with all of those masks. Never mind, that's my favorite. Oh good, they're staring you down while you're in the toilet. All right, next one. Holy moly. All right, how bad can it be? Holy shit. Well, hello there. I'm gonna lie, it does give me the heebie-jeebies. 
I don't know if cleaning is gonna do us any good. We should just set the whole damn thing on fire. Let's deal with it like adults. We're just gonna build a wall, the road just stay on one side, and you stay on the other. Live and let live. Well, it seems that the game doesn't really wanna let me get away with keeping those guys. Guess we're gonna have to vacuum them up. Well, it certainly is a wonderful night. Uh, I've been working a little bit on this house, and let me just give you the quick tour of the student's dump. Uh, we're gonna start off with what I would say is a, a very stylefully decorated hallway with these little cupids here. I don't know why, but I just felt they really pulled this hallway together. Next to the right, we have what I call the spider water bottle room. And with so many other things, I can't really tell you why. It's just, there's just something magical about this. It's more of a like a monument to the roaches that had to give their life so I could complete this job. Next up, we have the creepy clown hallway because no house is complete without a hallway full of creepy moving clown masks that stare you down. The bathroom also got a little bit of a renovation. It's called cat painting and red cups on the floor. It's a special design I just made for this. I mean, after all, I'm an artist. So for the next room, I wanted to kind of do something romantic. So I decided I would do something with candles. Specifically the skull candles that are everywhere. Also, it's a fire hazard, so like, you know, double whammy. And I didn't really know what to do with the living room, so I decided to turn it into lamp room. And it definitely has the biggest impact on me, or at least on my computer. Let me demonstrate. Well, it's a slideshow now. That's pretty much all the FPS I get. Oh boy, it's so slow. Oh boy. We could also call it the slideshow room. That doesn't roll off the tongue quite as well. Well, I'll say that was a huge success. I've been so busy with repairing and renovating other people's houses that I totally forgot about my little shack. I think this is a good start. I think uh, we can make this work. It's at least a good first step. I think that we'll have to do for this time. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to drop a like and I'll see you guys in the next one when we ruin more people's lives. Bye bye.